Why do we call this book Center Church? First, it's a call to biblically balanced, biblically centered ministry. The biblical plot line is creation, fall, redemption, and restoration. And we want ministry to be uh, controlled simultaneously all the time by all of those parts of the biblical narrative. Secondly, we call it Center Church because the ministry that we describe comes from urban and cultural centers. Things that have worked in cities often we find work in places outside of cities as well because today urban culture is so influential. Thirdly, we call it Center Church because we want ministry to be gospel-centered. It's possible to believe the gospel and proclaim the gospel and yet still not have your ministry completely shaped by the gospel but rather be more affected by religious legalism or modern pragmatism. Fourth, we call it Center Church because it presents a theological vision, which is in the middle between program and doctrine. In the early days of Redeemer, people came to me saying, tell us about the Redeemer model. And I came to realize there was no specific Redeemer program model the same way there was a seeker church model or a cell church model. Theological vision is the result of deep reflection on the gospel and on your culture. The result is a set of theological values, vision, emphases, skills that enable you to translate your doctrine into effective ministry in your particular place and time. And so we treat subjects like contextualization. How do you speak compellingly to people who don't believe what you believe? How do you holistically bring word and deed together in a way that doesn't compromise the gospel? How do you engage culture? How do you work effectively in cities? In all these ways, the book is addressing issues that Christian leaders and ministers around the world are wrestling with today.